Hello everybody, I'm Murray and uh, today my dad's going to be uh, re reviewing a, a light that he bought off of eBay uh, so I won't keep you too long. <laughs> Thanks for that introduction Murray. Um, hi everyone, it's Don from Crux Seminatus and today I've got a video um, about as Murray said about a light that I bought off eBay. Um, one of the most important things uh, I've learned is that I'm getting older now and my eyes are starting to struggle a little bit and with all the really bright lights it's a bit more difficult to uh, to do uh, fine detail painting. However, one of the best face painters uh, in the world or head painters in the world is a guy called um, Graham uh, Tester. Graham Tester. Uh, he goes by the Instagram of Rugabool and you should totally check him out, his stuff is exquisite. Uh, but he said, have I ever thought about getting um, little goggles, uh, magnification goggles? So what I'm gonna do is, I, because I wear glasses, it's very difficult for me to get a proper focus. So I went and I bought uh, this, so it's arrived today. Uh, it was 25 pounds plus a couple of pounds for shipping. It was the cheapest one I could find on eBay. Honestly, I don't know what to expect from it, but uh, let's find out. Ooh. Okay, so I just got stabbed by it. Oh my god! Oh no, no. Oh no, you're getting attacked. Yeah, well, there we go. Right, so um, clearly it's spring loaded. So careful. There you go. Top tip: if if you learn nothing else out of this video, uh, make sure that you're um, you're all right. So it's a brilliant tip. So here we go. Um, I'm going to do a video. This is like another um, pocket money versus Pro Tools. Um, one, I'm not entirely sure which one this falls into. £25 for a big diopter seems very realistic to me. Oh no, stuff falling over. Right, moment of truth. Let's find out if it works and what it's like. So, big spring loaded stuff as we know quite a large actual diopter itself and a light built into it as well so let's have a look and um, three two one go wow that's pretty cool that's a really nice uh, size of light the, the reason that modelers buy uh, diopters is for fine up de uh, close up detail so let's see what it looks like um, when you're trying to paint a, um, a mini whilst we're using it so Okay, so here's uh, here's a quick test of what it's going to look like. So I'm going to flip this uh, part over. So here is uh, a Space Marine. Um, hopefully you can see that. Um, hopefully that's in focus. So let's see. That's it right up against the glass. Let's see what the magnification is like. Hmm. That's pretty decent. That's getting a wee bit out of focus, but that's crystal clear. So in comparison, so that's under the diopter at that size, and that's um, with the naked eye. So I couldn't find any reviews that actually showed you what a difference that makes. So hopefully this will help you. And as I say, um, I just found this one on eBay. If anyone's interested, I'll, I'll pop a link to the one I bought. Um, but. You know, I paid for mine, it's not a freebie, so um, I'm sure you can find other ones around. But thanks for watching, and um, I've got a few videos planned for the next couple of weeks. I know I've been absent for a while, so thanks very much guys, and I'll speak to you later. Cheers, bye-bye.